Hi guys, today I'm bringing you another game in the IS-8 because the last one just wasn't good enough and then the day after I got this one and I just have to show it off. So I'm top tier in this game with each side has uh, 3 tier 9s and 3 tier 8s and 1 tier 7. I pity the tier 7s but yeah, we can't have it all. So at the start of the game I want everyone to go left. Uh, I look in the left direction because that I have to remind myself what is left because my left and my right aren't always um, matched up the way they should be. So after the countdown I do head left and I peek around the corner here because this is the best place to go down but I slow down because I don't want to damage myself driving down there. And as you can see my game is a little bit derpy with my ping not fluctuating at all. My frames per second take on some astronomical figures at some point and the word battle is in the game just about the entire game itself. So yeah, that's not very promising. But I see the E75 over there so I wait to aim and I get my first damage in before I drive on further because I do not want him to shoot me in the butt. The team has basically ignored what I said and the only one with me is the Tiger. And as more enemies get spotted, I worry for my team because they are in possibly the worst position to be in this map, namely the middle. But I'm hoping that my enemy team is as noob as my own team, because that will give me a lot of damage if I drive around them and they don't notice me. So I load Primo for the STI because he can be hard to hit for me. And as I look at him, he's really not looking at me. So I get to lay a shot him. I don't switch ammo because why would I? I love gold moving. And the rest of the enemy team is actually behind the building so they don't see me either. I reload, then I hit him again and then I switch to ammo because he's so not paying attention to me. So I can just sit here and wait to shoot him but someone else nicks the kill before I can. So next up are these three and the object is the biggest problem because he has the biggest gun. So I shoot him first, I get a little shot in turn but it's not that bad. The object is ignoring me, so I get another shot in before I pull back a little. And I decide to use the little station to my uh, advantage. I shoot T34 and because I moved he shot miss, so that's free damage for me. But he's not entirely stupid, he drives forward instead of back. So then I have to choose another target, and that's the T32, who does hit me in turn. But this little peekaboo boom hole works really well for me because I can just reload and shoot and then hide again and just wait to reload again while I can keep track of all the enemies there. So they're really not paying much attention to me and now the T32 is looking at me again but he hit the pole and not me so that's really nice of him. I think he doesn't want to hurt me so I just wait to reload and then I kill him. And that's another enemy gone. Now meanwhile, my team is very fast disappearing and I want to T30 out of my way. But he's actually waiting for me so he does shoot me, but I get to kill him anyway. And then the next target in line is the object as he pulls back and he's actually paying attention to the tiger instead of me. So I get a shot him before I pull back. And then I actually get shot uh, from the other side. So at first I think I'm gonna go around the building, but the tiger is there and I'm like, yeah, let's not do that. And it gives me some time to figure out who, where I was shot from and who to hit. Now he's no longer paying attention to me, so I get some free damage there. But more importantly, because he's no longer paying attention to me, I can actually focus on the object again. Because the object has a much bigger gun, it's a much bigger threat, because he can one-shot me. But I actually managed to bounce him, which is very lucky indeed and then I kill him. Now the KV4 is the next threat, but he shoots at the tiger and the tiger one kills him instead. And by now we're the only ones left against two enemies. I do not have that much confidence in the tiger, but he's still alive so that's helpful. And I want him with me because the E75 can one shot me, so I'm not very eager to meet him on my own. But I drive up anyway because I also want the kills and who knows, I might get lucky. And I do, because when I peek over and he's there, I shoot him and I kill him instantly, so the biggest threat is gone. Especially with the T29 hitting the car instead of me, so I can just wait to reload and he's still there, so he lets me shoot him, which is really nice. Now at first I wanted to pull back a little and wait to reload, but then I realized that the tiger could kill him as well and I kinda want that rattly. 
so I just rush in because I'm not a one shot for him anyway unless he managed to ammo wreck me and I barely aim before I shoot and then he's dead so yeah that was a pretty nice rap lane now I figured I'd probably have a first class or something because I wasn't entirely sure how much damage I managed to do but I actually did a whopping 6k damage and I got a nice little golden badge again so this was a really fun game for me and I hope you guys enjoyed watching the replay as well and I'll be seeing you guys the next time.